Hello! Today, we'll be showing you how to replace the motherboard in an HP 14 SMB Chromebook. First, you will need a few tools. An anti-static mat is recommended to prevent electrostatic discharge, which can damage electronic parts. A small, magnetic tip Phillips head screwdriver will be necessary for this replacement. You will need thermal paste during this replacement. A spudger will also come in handy during this replacement. You can use either plastic or metal, whichever you prefer. If you have tweezers, you might also want to have them handy, as they may be useful when dealing with small parts. The first step in the motherboard replacement process will be to remove the four small white rubber screw covers on the bottom cover. Next, you will remove all 13 bottom cover screws. Next, you will use your spudger to go around the perimeter of the palm rest assembly and carefully pry it up. Now, you will disconnect the touchpad cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the keyboard cable from the motherboard. Now that the palm rest assembly is removed, you will disconnect the battery cable from the motherboard. Next, you will remove the three battery screws, two of which are also holding in the speakers. Now, you will disconnect and completely remove the motherboard to USB board cable.
Next, you will disconnect the speaker cable from the motherboard. Next, you will remove the speakers and then remove the battery. Next, you will disconnect the two Wi-Fi antenna cables from the Wi-Fi card. Now, you will remove the Wi-Fi card screw and then remove the Wi-Fi card. Next, you will disconnect the LCD cable from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the fan cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the power cable from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the ALS board cable from the motherboard. Next, you will remove the cables from around the fan and then remove the three fan screws. Now, you will remove the fan. Next, you will remove the ALS board screw. Now, you will remove the three motherboard screws. Now, you will remove the motherboard. Next, you will loosen the four heat sink screws and then remove the heat sink from the motherboard. Now, you will remove the SSD card screw and then remove the SSD card from the motherboard. The first step in the installation of your replacement motherboard will be to apply thermal paste to the CPU on the motherboard. Next, you will set the heat sink into place on the motherboard and tighten the four heat sink screws.
Now, you will replace the SSD card and the SSD card screw. Next, you will set the motherboard into place and replace the three motherboard screws. Now, you will replace the ALS board screw. Now, you will replace the fan and the three fan screws. Next, you will reroute the wires around the fan. Now, you will replace the Wi-Fi card and the Wi-Fi card screw. Next, you will reconnect the two Wi-Fi antenna cables to the Wi-Fi card. Now, you will reconnect the power cable to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the fan cable to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the ALS board cable to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the LCD cable to the motherboard. Next, you will set the battery and speakers back into place. Now, you will reconnect the speaker cable to the motherboard. Next, you will replace the three speaker and battery screws.
Now, you will reconnect the motherboard to USB board cable. Next, you will reconnect the battery cable to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the keyboard cable on the palm rest assembly to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the touchpad cable to the motherboard. Now you will snap the palm rest assembly into place on the bottom cover. Next, you will replace the 13 bottom cover screws. The final step will be to replace the four white rubber screw covers on the bottom cover. You have now successfully replaced the motherboard in your HP Chromebook. Good job!